Good afternoon. The first item of business this afternoon is time for reflection. And our time for reflection leader today is Reverend Father Gregory Umuno, parish priest, St Stephen's Parish, Blair Gowrie. The presiding officer, Right Honourable Alison Johnston, Honourable members of this Scottish Parliament, many thanks for inviting me to share a reflection with you today. As you gather here from time to time to discern, debate, and find solutions to the countless issues of our time, permit me to share with you a principle of engagement which recommends as its maxim, doing good better. This principle makes clear that merely doing good is no longer enough. We should always aim at doing good better. I choose to ground this principle on the three metaphors which Jesus used to refer to these those called to be gatekeepers of the community that the evangelist Matthew addressed in Matthew chapter 5, verses 13 to 16. And I put, you are the salt of the earth. You are the light of the world. And you are that city built on the hilltop that cannot be hidden. Permit me to use these metaphors to address you, parliamentarians, since for me, you too are the gatekeepers of our society. You are the salt of the earth. You are the light of the world. And you are that city built on a hilltop. Essentially, salt purifies, seasons, and preserves to enhance the tastes of precious valuables and to preserve humanly flourishing values for generations unborn. Equally, light was the first thing that God created and separated it from darkness. In darkness, we stumble and fall, but in light, we see our paths clearly. The hope is that gatekeepers of our society, we continue to bear the light, doing good better in reducing poverty, unemployment, and homelessness here at home, and tyranny and oppression abroad. These shortcomings remind us that whenever there is a want of right leadership, people suffer. Finally, honorable members, you are that city on the hilltop of life and in full view of public eyes. And so from that hilltop, let your light and your humanly flourishing values continue to shine forth. I'll close this reflection by invoking a Swedish diplomat by name, Dag Hammarskjöld. Doug served as the second Secretary General of the United Nations from 1953 to 1961. He once said, the longest journey is the journey inwards. This man, Doug, traveled worldwide, but did not reach his journey's end. In his inward exploration, he said that the journey inward is a never-ending journey. This view 
for me, typifies the mission of each member of this honorable chamber. As you seek to grapple with the ever-changing, multifaceted, and complex issues of our postmodern society. Thank you. Thank you, Reverend Jimenez.